when it comes to titanium implants, there is one company every dentist knows, and it's Strawman. They're one of the biggest players in the game, maybe even the biggest. Their standard plus tissue level implant is one of the most studied and successful implant systems ever. But how does this titanium titan perform in the world of zirconia? I've pulled together all the crucial facts about the Strawman Pure Ceramic System, so stick around till the end because I'm giving away my Zirconi Systems Black Book for free. It's packed with essential insights and data on all the major ceramic implant systems out there. Hi, my name is Dr. Tobias Steinherr and as a specialist for ceramic implants and metal-free dentistry, I am teaching you the dental skills, the biological concepts and the practical implementation of ceramic implants in your practice to increase your revenue and decrease your stress while creating healthier smiles for healthier patients. Today, we are tackling another big player in the ceramic implant world and that's Strawman and their Pure System. If you've been following along, you know we've already covered SDS and Sarah Root. Now let's dive into what Strawman brings to the table. So we are sticking to our usual five criteria from the Zirconia Systems Black Book I mentioned earlier. Basically, Strawman offers two options. One one-piece implant called the Pure Monotype and a two-piece implant simply known as Pure. Biologically speaking, both implants are somewhere between tissue level and bone level designs. Here's the catch, you can't prep the implant shoulder. So you need to place it subgingerly. Strawman suggests positioning the shoulder uh, about 1.8 millimeters above the bone level. With the one-piece implant, the crown sits right on top of the shoulder. This means the crown margin ends up about 1 to 2 millimeters below the gum line on the buckle side and maybe even 3 to 4 millimeters subgingival in the proximal areas. You'll seal this margin with cement you have to clean later. Now the two-piece implant is a different story. It uses a titanium core similar to their tie base. The titanium abutment is covered by a ceramic crown layer, so it looks all ceramic from the outside, but inside there is the titanium base and the titanium screw holding everything together. And here's where it gets interesting. It's not 100% metal-free, which might matter to you, plus the connection between the two ceramic surfaces isn't sealed with cement. This could lead to a tiny gap, and gaps can invite biofilm formation because two rigid zirconia surfaces won't seal perfectly on their own. So is this a deal breaker? Well, maybe and maybe not. There is no independent study confirming if this is a real issue or just theoretical, but it's something to keep in mind when choosing your implant system. On the upside, thanks to the tie base and the titanium screw, you get one of the most stable connections out there. The two-piece implant offers plenty of zirconia in the shoulder area and the titanium abutment adds some flexibility under dynamic loading. When it comes to simplicity and options, here is the lowdown. The two-piece implant only comes in one 4.1 millimeter diameter. The pure monotype also offers a smaller 3.3 millimeter size. While they stick to essential diameters, they do provide four different lengths. It's 8, 10, 12, and even 14 millimeters. Even though the design is parallel like their strong and bone level implant, you can even use the same drills, the threat is on the more aggressive side. So immediate implants are definitely in play if the 4.1 millimeter diameter suits your needs. Unlike SDS or Serra Root, where you can prep the implant and place your final crown like a natural tooth, Strawman's two-piece implant lets you create screw retained crowns. They also offer locator abutments in various heights, giving you the flexibility for both fixed and removable dentures. If you're mostly doing late implants, the limited diameters might not be a big issue unless you are working in tight spaces, then you would need to opt for the monotype for a smaller diameter. Overall, it's a straightforward system offering options for fixed and removable dentures with a solid titanium-based connection. This boosts stability, but also means it's not entirely metal-free. If you're already a fan of Strawman bone level titanium implants, you will feel right at home. You can even use the same drills, as I already mentioned. It might be just the perfect way to step into the world of ceramic implants. 
If you want all those facts in one spot at a glance, click on the link in the description box below this video to download your copy of my Zirconia Systems Black Book. This will provide you with an overview of all major ceramic implant systems, not only Stroma, but also SDS, Ceraroot, Set Systems, Ceramix, Camlock, and Noble BioCare. So make sure you download the PDF and subscribe to the channel as we'll continue our video series about the major ceramic implant systems to give you all the data you need to decide which system fits your requirements the best. Because if we can do better, we should do better.